On my way to Cars and Cigars, Sanford, Florida. Beautiful afternoon. Hottest balls out here. Okay, check out this cold start on the GT3. Soul exhaust that Anthony installed last night. Wrapping up cars and cigars. Walked around a little bit, but there really wasn't anything that stood out to me. I ended up coming to my house because it ended earlier than I thought. I said one thing about McLaren's. McLaren's have too many buttons, too many weird sounds. There's all kinds of sensors, buttons. Like, look at this. Stop beeping. Stop beeping. God damn it. Oh my god, you hearing this guys? The other thing is Florida forecasts cannot be trusted. It said it was gonna rain today. I haven't seen not even one drop of rain. In fact, it turned out to be a beautiful afternoon. The funnest part of going to any of these events is always the driving, man. Yo, check this guy out. You know me and C Travis, Top Promotions, I got VMP, Summer Solstice Festival, all in the beginning. This is my first big festival. Boom Shakalak is returning every Thursday, so it'll be here as well. Big things coming Thanks up. Thanks for inviting me, bro. That's pretty cool. Thanks for inviting me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to all the way to the top. You gotta support your people, bro. That's the only way, man. It takes a team to dig the dream, you know what I'm saying? More than just that, it takes positive Jedi's to get to the top, bro. And we some Jedi's. Every year you see less and less of these. BBS wheels, pop-up headlights, guys. This thing is insane. Damn, bro, they got Drake soft with that fucking song, dude. Jesus Christ. I started out with a Miata, bro. I jumped from a Miata to the Porsche. I jumped from the Porsche to McLaren. How the fuck did I do that and you can't? And then you're talking about like, man, you guys gotta like, like get on this level. Like, what level, dude? You're on level one. I'm not trying to hate. I'm just, I want my boys to be up, man. And like, if you're, if you think you're already on level 10, level 1,000 and you're on level one, like, come on, bro. If you have an entry level car from like 2018, you can't be posting that kind of stuff. I don't even post that kind of shit. The guy next to me, like, I want to be on that fucking level. And like, beyond them, bro. Working a nine to five with your Mustang or your Corvette, like, and you're satisfied and you're like, you think you made it and shit. Like, you're out of, you're out of your mind, bro. I'm just being honest, like, I want those guys to grow. I think it's also the group of people you hang out with the most. Me hanging out with guys that have like much more shit than me makes me want to get like more shit. If I would, like had the Miata and I hung out with Miata people still, I'd probably still have a Miata. Satisfied. The point is not to be satisfied. You got a Bugatti, you want a yacht. You got a yacht, you want a jet. But that's part of life, bro. So you're not pushing yourself, you're just chilling. And it's not gonna come by itself. You gotta put in the, the work. I probably sound like a mega asshole that you sometimes hurts, bro. I've never met a guy who's super successful and said, oh man, I just, I work my nine to five. Unless they got really fucking lucky. I literally came home from work, dude. Seven o'clock at night to midnight every night learning how to fucking code. Until I fucking learned how to code. I didn't like come home and be like, oh, I'm tired. I'm gonna go to sleep. If you have the energy to watch Netflix and you have the energy to play video games, then you have the fucking energy to sit down and learn something new. You're just lazy. You really don't want it. Because if you want it, you get it, bro. You can get whatever you put your mind to. The universe gives back what you put out, bro. Like talking about cars is fine. It's fun. That should be like a side thing. That's a side quest, bro. Like you can't change people, bro. It's so loud, man. Look, I got speakers on all the fucking bumpers, bro. This thing is fucking lit, bro. There's so many people here. Not only that, but the environment is pretty cool. Everybody's pretty relaxed out here. Normal people enjoying cars, music, and food. Look at this, guys. This thing is so fucking clean. Little carbon fiber lip here. I really like this color. It really stands out. Carbon fiber here on the mirror. Matte gold. Mopar. You guys let me know what you think about this Camaro with the butterfly doors. These wheels are clean, bro. What is this, an M M3? Alex's C8. Anthony's GT. Three, my car. Sick, dude. For those of you guys who don't know, this whole car, carbon fiber, both carbon inside, air vents that come from the front. I meant to take a look at this earlier, but I got distracted. You just can't go wrong with a super. You got the carbon fiber wing here. The interior is in mint condition, man. Holy crap. Homie has a big turbo, two JZ engines, big ass air intake, inner cooler. The boys had to head out. I'm gonna stay maybe an hour more. I wanted to go on that drive back home, but I guess I'm gonna stay a little bit longer. Yo, check out the vibe body kit on this car. You know, I like it because it's got a bolt on. Easy, I got an antipode. Too many guys with these, like, bars that go up and shit. Okay, he's always in the line right now. Go quiet! We're about to win this shit, bro. It's gonna go to my man Scott. 